Hey, what's going on, family? Jay Cruz here, Healthy Bearded. Well, this is, I've been talking about this type of series for a long time, but it's finally here. I'm actually recording on the GoPro 10, and basically, this is what's going on, right? I'm about to go into Target. I'm actually out here in the parking lot. I'm about to go into Target with my GoPro and look for some, first of all, I wanna see what's available at Target currently uh, as far as beard products. I'm gonna look for some grooming stuff too, and let's see what would be my recommendation if you currently find yourself going to target or plan to go there for your beer products let's go let's talk about it Reducing beard wash. Old GX, the first and only gray reducing beard wash. That's pretty. I've never seen that before. Huh. Well, let me see if I can find beard oil. Oh, no, no, no. That's the shaving products right there. Yeah. That's the shaving products. No, no, no. Be a man. <laughs> Good fella. Never heard of this brand. Do they have beer stuff? Face lotion, candles, body lotion. Oh, Scotch Porter. Okay, so beard wash, Scotch Porter. I've heard good things about the old Scotch Porter. Um, I, I heard they had a really good conditioner. This is their beard balm. Now, interestingly enough, it says intense hydration. Ooh, look at this beard balm. First ingredient, I don't know if it's gonna pick it up, but first ingredient is water. And this is for a beard balm. Uh, I don't know how I feel about that. If anything, let me see the rest of the ingredients. Castor seed oil, obsidian oil. There is shea butter in here. This might be more of a beard butter than a beard balm though. So, it's weird though. Just because the water is the first ingredient, I probably would pass on that. Conditioning beard balm, that's probably beard butter. Beard spray, beard and hair conditioning spray. Hmm. Yeah, start with the Interesting. Okay, so we talked about that. He's Maestro's Beard Butter. I never tried this company before, but let's see. First ingredients: water. Again, water. I don't understand why people would put water in a beard butter. Just based off that, I'm not reaching for this. I wouldn't recommend it for beard butter. Now, if you're talking about a um, a conditioner, or beard shampoo, that's different, but. This is their beard wash they have available. Beard oil, okay. Let me see this. Ingredients. I just got the Mestro's beard wash, I mean beard oil, and I noticed that it has like the first couple of ingredients are silicones. Now I've never reviewed this product. Uh, I have a colleague of mine that reviewed it and he said it wasn't good. <laughs> So, I just, yeah, and I understand, like I said, big box stores, you gotta have certain ingredients in it to like, for a longer shelf life, but first couple of ingredients are silicones, it's gonna be a pass for me. Next thing though, of course, you have Beard Brand. Now, Beard Brand, I have reviewed, and listen, it does have glycerin, but that's okay for this. Jojoba, apricot, grape seed, grapefruit, Oil, uh, seed extract 
this would probably be a safer choice and like i've tried their gold line which is very expensive but this right here you can definitely get like a pass so good choice beard oil if you need something in the crunch beard brand in the store they got beard wash fifteen dollars for this bottle beard softener you know what i actually started my beard journey with them what else they have uncle jimmy thick hair growth serum biotin ginseng avocado hmm okay black seed oil let me see the ingredients Castor oil, sesame seed oil, sunflower, avocado, ginseng. There's a couple of things here that I'm not 100% familiar with, so I would have to research, but I've never seen this before. Uncle Jimmy's Thick Hair Growth Serum. I do not. I can't emphasize this. I do not like this when companies do this beard growth oil. A blend of essential oils and extracts that will leave your beard softened and shine. Ingredients, sesame seed oil, sunflower, soybean. I am not a fan of soybean oil. I tried another product. What was it? Um, it was... Boss man, boss man, it had soybean oil and it left my beard greasy. So, so soybean oil is actually like a cheap filler oil too. So, yeah. <laughs> okay, so I've been seeing these like, I've seen them on like a couple of ads, but it's Shea Moisture for men. And this is their beard oil and this is their beard balm. And I have to say, based off ingredients alone, it's actually not bad. You got grapeseed oil, sunflower seed oil, olive oil, castor seed oil, sweet almond, fragrance, shea, coconut oil, kernel oil, and then the beard balm. No water, which is a good thing, <laughs> but it has castor seed oil, shea butter, coconut oil, um, grapeseed oil. Now, grapeseed oil is like... It could be a hit or a miss for my beard. Like I've had products that have grapeseed and oil, grapeseed oil that actually did pretty good. And then I had products that had grapeseed oil and did horrible. So I think it really comes down to also like quality, like cold pressed organic, but Shea Moisture, pretty good stuff. Based off ingredients alone, like. Okay, Duke Cannon, best damn beard oil. Let me see this. Ingredients, kernel oil, jojoba, argan, essential, cedar wood, silica, okay. Ah, uh, clove essential oil, doesn't look that bad. I would have to check both of these right here. They're probably like, hmm, but uh, Duke Cannon, hmm, not bad. Uh, there's two things right there that I don't know exactly. I would have to look them up. I'll put them up in the video right now so you guys can see exactly what they are, the ingredients, but... Duke Cannon, Beer Balm, Shea Butter, Lanolin Oil, Beeswax. Hmm, actually, based off ingredients alone, this Beer Balm is a pass for me. Yeah, I know these ingredients, they're, yeah, pretty good. Yeah, this is a, this is a pass, this is good. Beard amplifier. Now this is different with hydrating beard cream. Ah, water. Okay. Okay. I wonder if this is their like thing of beard butter, but yeah. Oh, shout out to Beard Vato. There's some uh, cream out there. But popcorn. Oh, there is cream little stuff right here. Te desvestiste, lo hicimos en la habitación. Qué rico, mami. Pero en. You know what? I'm gonna buy this beard oil and this beard bomb. 
I'm going to buy both of these because based off ingredients, I didn't really see an issue with them. So let's go ahead and buy them. But this is what I found here at Target. So pretty cool thing, right? So I went ahead and bought this and it came out to $20. But what I didn't realize was they gave me a $5 gift card for next time when I come in. So I got both these products in a way for $15. And again, this is the Shea Moisture. And we're going to see how this does. But uh, based off ingredients alone, man, I think it's a I think it's a hit. Now, please be mindful. Please show me some grace and mercy. It was my first time recording in a store like this, uh, like in a Target. So but uh, yeah, we're going to keep these videos coming. We're going to do a couple of more. We're going to hit up all the stores, Walmart, Costco. If you have any recommendations for stores or places like that, let me know down below. But yep, this is Jay Cruz and we are out.